Hey guys, welcome to the OR. For our next case, we're going to be doing a breast augmentation. This is a special breast augmentation because it is a gender affirming surgery for this patient. And so we are going to be using silicone implants for a nice natural feel. We're going to be using an incision in the breast fold, which is somewhat ill-defined, so I'm choosing an ideal location for it. And come and have a look. So for gender affirming top surgery, patients have the same options. So essentially we can use all of the same incisions. We can go in through the breast fold. We can use a areolar incision. Or we can use a transaxial incision. Same implant choices as well. There's some difference in that there tends to be not as much breast tissue development depending on hormone use. Um, and so the implant itself will define more of the shape of the final breast than the breast tissue itself. So we have made our pockets now underneath the muscle. So we've made our submuscular space. We're all ready for the implant to go in. So these are 485 cc high profile silicone implants. Again, when you have minimal breast tissue, the silicone is gonna give you the most natural feel. And this will be a nice bubbly round shape, but still very sort of elegant and sort of proportional to her frame. And we're all done. Come and have a look. Beautiful result. It's gonna take some time for the implants to settle, but this is a lovely round shape and I think she'll be very happy.